For the test, we need the I-2019 dissolved ozone meter, the light shield, the zeroing ampule, the activator solution, the 25 milliliter test cup, and the test ampule. So the first step is going to be zeroing the meter. We need to turn it on. When I turn it on, the O3 symbol appears. I'm going to take the zeroing ampule. This is included with each kit. I am going to press it all the way down into the port. I am going to put the light shield over it. And then I am going to press the zero test button. The O3 symbol will flash for about eight seconds and then the screen will read 0.0.0. .0. It is now ready to be used for the dissolved ozone test. So I'm going to remove the zeroing ampule and set that aside. I'm going to keep the light shield out. Now this next step we have to move really quickly in. When you're working with dissolved ozone samples, the dissolved ozone can break down really fast. And so you have to take the reading almost immediately after taking your sample so that the levels of dissolved ozone are the same in the test as they are in the sample. So I'm going to first explain each of the steps of the process and then I'm going to do them very quickly. So the first step is going to be putting five drops of activator solution in the test cup. The next step is going to be filling the test cup up to the 25 milliliter point and then I am going to put this vacuum sealed ampule inside the sample, snap the tip off, it will immediately fill with the sample and then I'm going to put this in the meter and measure the ozone. I want to briefly explain also how I'm getting my dissolved ozone sample. This is a bottle that we carry that has dissolved ozone in its chamber and then when this button is pressed it produces dissolved ozone which comes out this nozzle. So this is what I'll be spraying into the test cup with the activator solution and using for the sample that we'll then measure with the meter. So the first step is to put the five drops of activator solution in the sample cup. Then the next step is to fill the sample cup up to the 25 milliliter point with dissolved ozone. I am then going to put the ampule in, snap off the tip, it instantly fills with the sample. I'm going to quickly dry it and then I'm going to press it into the meter, pushing it all the way down. Put the light shield on. And then press the zero test button. The O3 symbol will flash for about three seconds and then the reading will appear. In our test we have 2.64 parts per million dissolved ozone in our sample. 